So here's my uh, crypto miner. At the moment, it's there's three of them. Uh, I've got four, but I need to reinstall the operating system on it because the SSD corrupted. So there's a uh, nine cards in that one. Nine cards in that one. Nine in this one, and the other one's got um, eight in that one. I've had to. If you, I'm not sure if you can see, but in there, there's a riser card. I don't know if it will focus. It's a new camera. I barely use it. Yeah, there it is. That riser card extender, which basically turns one PCIe X1 into four USB ports for the GPU risers. Because my board could only take, I think it was about six. I needed to put nine on it. And then I'm linking it up to solar like this week, I've got to basically run that whole machine on solar, including the fourth one. At the moment it's running just on normal power, I've got the sockets up here which are on solar. That follows around over to the 2000 watt inverter. My battery bank's here but I'm toying with doing an 18650 like Tesla battery wall on here. Uh, of course got fire alarm up there. Ready in the office. Just Press in case test. since it is in a bloody wooden log cabin. Tidied up my Ethernet cables today. They go through to the miner, down to the switch, and then down to the main house. Got my security here. Um, the relays down here will be sending control signals to the computers. So basically, it will just have the power switches on there, and then I'm going to have power relays as well. So I can just cut the power if anything happens. Um, but those relays are at the moment, so I can remotely shut it down or reboot it and all hard reset it. Got a night vision camera in here, um, which runs all the time, captures any motion. As soon as someone walks in here, it starts recording the video and it sends me a notification. Um, so, in total, there is about 600 or maybe 700 amp hours, 2000 watt inverter, two charge controllers because it's got a set of six panels on the roof and six panels out there, which is about 3.5, maybe 4 kilowatts in total. Um, and if I want to turn on the Inverter, just press the button on both switches. Um, for example, I should easily show you that I'm getting power up the solar now. Just plug this in to the solar socket and it runs. I've got to say though, this inverter does have some weird. I don't know what's going on with it, but it's out putting 140 volts and I need 130. So as soon as I plug it into one of these power supplies, it starts humming a lot. And it's really worrying. Um, so yeah, that's, that's the whole setup. Crypto mining, switching over to solar power. Total of 35 GPUs. Not there though. I've got the other one. So yeah, that's it.